the West Riding of Yorkshire. Always a delight to be here as Elland Road. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Leeds United up against Arsenal. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Well, this game should offer plenty. Arsenal get it going. And they need to get tighter. Just the challenge that was required. A really sumptuous ball. Real chance. Oh, he's given it. Penalty. And an opportunity now for them to jump in front. And it's also going to be a booking. Well, he's absolutely right. It's a penalty and a yellow card. Can he make it 1-0? And the keeper denies them from the spot. Llorente. Adams. Well, can they be creative from here? Might jump in front. Oh, that is a superb save. In it goes at the second time of asking. And the keeper feels hung out to dry. Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately, it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. Arsenal restart the game then, and they have work to do as they try to wipe out that last goal. Alexander Zinchenko it's with Erdogan and Leeds have it back now Mark Rocca a real opening now sound piece of goalkeeping Not a great pass. Zinchenko. He has time to play it over. Just the clearance that was called for. Adams. Patrick Bamford. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. He's found a pocket of space. Oh, in with a chance. And it's gone in beyond the goalkeeper. Arsenal level. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. goal so back underway. One goal apiece here. Jesus. Jesus. Arsenal have given it away.
It does appear to be opening up on the flank for Arsenal here. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Not a pity that. It looked promising, but that's going to be claimed by the keeper. And that is offside. Martinelli succeeded in keeping it in play and well, a good tackle and plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position are they going to forge ahead shot blocked but still alive that is a really disappointing effort, goodness me. On that occasion, just didn't make the right sort of contact. Should be testing the goalkeeper from that sort of range. Well, the stats don't lie. Arsenal have had most of the possession, but they haven't done enough with it, particularly in the midfield areas, where their passing has been far too safe. And that needs to change quickly if they're to win this one. Well, first things first, they need the ball again. Magnificent defending. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Will they profit from this situation? In position, and saved by the keeper. And over comes the corner. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Let's see about the delivery. Struggling to get it away. Well, nothing untoward happened. Under real pressure defensively, will they pay the price? The cross is on. Must take the lead here. Oh, but he's missed it. How on earth is this still level? Well, I just don't know, Derek. Just a real lack of composure in the end. They should be ahead now. Untidy on the ball. And the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. Well, no card handed out, but quite a few upset players out there, Stuart. Well, he's made a genuine attempt to play the ball, so penalty yes, yellow card no. And they will make the change now. So, to make it 2-1. And the penalty is converted. A goal it is. And now he can exhale. Well, here's the replay. And the goalkeeper dives early. And that's why he goes straight down the middle. What a good penalty. Watch the goalkeeper all the way. Excellent.
And that is going to be all for the first 45 here at Elland Road. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. He's in with a chance. In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Arsenal Underway again with the score at 3-1. Frente. Tyler Adams and Christensen has it Junior Firpo chance to attack using width and credit is due for that good piece of defending and well, that's a well-timed pass and Gabriel Jesus he's in behind well, that's a moment he'd like to airbrush from history. Not a good attempt. Well, lots of power, but no control whatsoever. That's a real waste. Coming onto the pitch, number 13, Joe Gallant. Christensen. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. And there to intervene. Well, the stats don't lie. Arsenal had most of the possession. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Wasted possession again. And Leeds have the throw. Luis Sinistera and the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage Mark Roca possession and patience the watchwords and that is how to tackle inside your own penalty area Gabriel Jesus Jesus an encouraging Arsenal move will he play it in Junior Firpo might be a chance here can he find the net tenacious tackling excellent defending there Take it away. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Really important piece of last ditch defending. Mark Roca. Sinistera. Delivering it into the box. A lovely attempt. And splendid goalkeeping. Well, it's a decent attempt, but in the end, not enough. And as you say, good goalkeeping. Jesus. Intelligent threaded pass here. Not away completely. And he's done well to tip it over the bar. 
corner awarded to Arsenal can someone get on the end of this pressing high and they have the ball again and space to cross it Now we're inside the final 10 minutes in this one. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And he's made headway. Oh, he's missed it. And that might be their fate seal. Well, that must be it. He surely had to score there. And the substitution will occur now. To be replaced by number three, Kieran Tierney. Granit Xhaka Xhaka well they stopped them in their tracks Junior Firpo plenty of running room in the wide position well he had to read it and get there and did Arsenal's free kick here Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Mark Rocca. An alert intervention. The referee's verdict is three additional minutes. And space for them here on the flank. Crossing into the middle. Well, sadly for him, he had taken up an illegal position. Yeah, it's a real waste, because that was an excellent bit of play out wide. So there it is, the final whistle, and a satisfying outcome for Arsenal and the many fans around the world. What did you think of their performance as a whole? Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice, incisive play too. It's a good result for them. Well, very hard to keep quiet, as is often the case. Gabriel Jesus, interested to get your verdict. Well, he looked a top-class player today. 